Welcome to the freaking crazy show. This is your boy freaking crazy guy and in today's episode we are playing another game of Jurassic World Evolution. We are continuing our journey through the Return to Jurassic Park DLC. Um, This DLC is super fun. I am really enjoying it. It's kind of like a flashback of like what if they came back to Jurassic Park and fixed it up. Um, like during the first movie, obviously uh, in the first movie, they kind of just like escaped and let it rot. But this, they uh, pretty much came back and made it thrive. So um, I'm really having fun with this. But uh, yeah, if uh, if you don't know what's really happened, I'm pretty much just going through the objectives. Uh, I In the last episode, I just finished it. Uh, it's the number six mission. Um, but yeah, if you didn't see it, I recommend go checking it out. Um, but yeah, without further ado, we'll continue on with the uh, number seven mission and uh, get this all taken care of. I think this might be the last one also, so uh, let's go ahead and do that. Yep, it looks like it's going to be the last mission, so that's going to be a lot of fun. So achieve a total guest count of 800, easy, and then add a T-Rex to the park, also easy. All right, sounds good to me. All right, so we're going to need a T-Rex. So then we're going to, well, I'm going to, I'm going to go ahead and modify him. All right, so I think, yep, we don't have the T-Rex and we don't have the Baryonyx and we don't have the Velociraptor. <sighs> All right, so I'm going to head ahead. I'm going to go ahead and get a... Um, the fossil genomes for these guys and uh, I'll be right back a few moments later all right so we got our complete genome for the t-rex let's go ahead and modify him and uh, incubate him so, t-rex right over yep right here All right, let's go and incubate this guy. All right, so our T-Rex is ready to be released. Let's go ahead and deliver him to his nice little pen that I made while we've been gone. Uh, got a huge problem. The Raptors, their pens are open and the emergency bunkers have been disabled. You suspect more sabotage? I have zero doubt. Uh, okay. Where in the hell is Cabot? You think he's involved in this, John? Most certainly not. Do you? Let's not uh, ready for anyone out. Perhaps that is wise. I this cannot we'll open the up the first, shelters. Or at least keep it to a minimum. Yes. Go. Whatever it takes. We've seen the reports, Ian. So no sugar coating. Just how bad is it? Wild there's rabbits, one alpha predators there's two in the park probably hunting definitely hunting and our guests are their most obvious prey we can try and trank them agreed and let's tell john to close the park down before the panic sets in it's uh, too late for that dr sattler closing would only make things worse funneling people together and creating bigger targets besides god dang it closing the park hammond would never go for it where have I seen and lived this story before? Oh, that's right. I believe oh, it was on this geez. Very spot. Then we'll tranquilize them. It'll work. It has to. Yeah. You guys are not coming through here, suckers. Yep, nope. <laughs> Luckily, I foresaw this and made a stupid, like, pens around him. So... Yeah, let's go freaking keep going with this, shall we? Let's go. There we go. Uh, where's our... Where's my guys? Uh... Yep. Uh... Where are you? What are you guys doing over there? Freaking go and get them. Haha, <laughs> they are stuck in those mother freaking cages. All right, let's go drive. Ah! 
because I already knew that these guys weren't gonna come. Oh. There's one. Guarding the dinosaurs didn't work. I'm oh. Curious. These raptors have been modified genetically. What? I mean. So what? What? You're saying that they're mutants? They're unique expressions of a specific strain of raptor DNA. So, mutants. Whoever's behind the hacks and sabotage did something to make the dinosaurs immune to sedation. <laughs> Someone is attacking Jurassic Park from within and using its inhabitants okay. to do it. Then that is how we'll release it. What do you have in mind? Though? The T Rex. We turn her loose. Um, what? No, no, let's not do that. Chaos, Ian. Isn't that what you wanted? Malcolm, it saved us before. Uh, she want to establish dominance immediately, which means she's going to go after the raptors. Uh, not like this. Didn't John Hammond tell you whatever it takes? Well, this is what it takes a T Rex. <sighs> I hate this place. Oh no. All right. Um so I'm going to have to get my T-Rex. Is that what we're doing? Is that Where's my T-Rex at? Oh, he is so unhappy. All right. Uh tranquilize. Where is my other one? Okay. I don't know where. Oh, maybe I could lure him. Okay. Uh. Yes. Yes. I think I could do that. Uh, there we go. Um, break this, break this. There we go. There we go. There we go. Oh, yeah. There we go. All right. I think. Got to be cool. You've made history. You guys were not. Destroy my stuff. Yes. <laughs> that is awesome. Kill them. Oh, yeah. Oh, no. Okay, uh, come on, T-Rex. Go after them. Okay. Oh, jeez. What? The heck is going on here? Okay. All right. Uh, yeah. Repair crew on route. Come on, T Rex. Go get them. Oh, you already got one. Haha. <laughs> awesome. Picking up asset. All right. You got two more to go, man. I don't know where those guys are at. Okay. Nice. I think I trapped them again. Sweet. Nope. He escaped. God dang you. Where are you at? 
This one I am totally afraid of. What is he doing? Alright, well, he's gonna get nowhere, so that's good. Like all living creatures yes. Oh, wow. Make sure they have it. All right, last one, man. Let's go get him. Yes, he's after him. Oh! Oh, okay. Wow. Thank you. All right. Uh, okay. Sweet deal. Let's go and, um, get this guy back in his cage. Oh my God. All right. Let's go ahead and get these fixed. At task. Go ahead and repair those. All right, let's drive the vehicle then, because my guy is doing nothing. Is he? Ah, okay. That is a... Uh, that is a very questionable uh, <laughs> position there. Okay, let's, uh, yeah, let's go take him back to his own cage, all right? Right over here. En route to pick up the asset. And let's close back this gate. Oh, sweet. Well, there you go. I knew that was going to happen. At the very beginning, I pretty much so did all of those fences all around it just because I, I knew it was going to happen. They are my only real competition at the moment. And I needed to stop them before they can do any more harm to Ingen and to Jurassic Park, of course. I knew they wouldn't give up after their first attempt. So then, Finch's disappearance was all part of the plan. Am I not allowed to have some surprises of my own, Dr. Malcolm? Huh. I'm starting to like you, John. Huh. So, Bison didn't get to you, Cabot? Of course not. I was working a con from the inside for Mr. Hammond. John, keeping us out of the loop like before, it's not exactly inspiring confidence. But why? Because he didn't trust us. Isn't that right, John? Our previous uh, uh, difficulties were the result of an inside job. Regrettable, really. Still, I needed to be sure that no one else was involved. Okay, but why Cabot? His mother is one of my biggest investors. I've always loved dinosaurs. My mother invested on my behalf. It was just a lucky break that John was looking for someone with my skill set. She's worth billions. Quiet money. Who would ever have known? <laughs> right. So you don't worry about money? Worry about? No. Obsess over it? Well, <laughs> I confess. Consider me guilty. Which is why I think young Cabot here has become such a valued asset. Because he, he adds the greed factor. Science and art have always needed commerce, Dr. Malcolm. You can't change that reality. But John, mm. changing reality is precisely what you've done with Jurassic Park. And only time will reveal the extent. Yeah, he is awesome. For the good. Ellie's right. This has the potential to be a place where people can truly learn from the past. And repeat its mistakes. No, you're wrong, Ian. They're not mistakes. These dinosaurs are beautiful animals. They deserve the chance we've given them. They deserve Jurassic Park. Time mm. always tells, doesn't it? Isn't that true of everything? Yep. Everything takes time. And money. We have both. And now the world has a place. This place. To visit these wonderful creatures. Thanks to you, the dinosaurs live. Jurassic Park lives. Or as uh, Dr. Malcolm would put it, we found a way. Hmm. That is awesome. Well, we completed mission number seven, which is all the missions. Uh, I don't know what will happen once I hit OK. Maybe there'll be a secret mission. Who knows? Um, but let's see what we got here. Uh, yep. Mission complete. 
mission number seven, six hundred thousand dollars. We got the Velociraptor now, uh, success rate three point oh, incubation speed three point oh, and the Drivable Park Tour is now available. All right. Yep, that was the end of that. I don't like. All right. So I literally just finished uh, this DLC. Pretty short DLC, but very freaking awesome DLC. Um, I really enjoyed this one. Um, what I plan on doing is I'm going to go ahead and keep playing this uh, Return to the Jurassic Park DLC until I get all of these missions complete. Um, but yeah, that is freaking uh, craziness. Uh, but yeah, let's go keep pushing on through, shall we? All right. So for our missions, I already completed, as we've been playing this game, I already completed John Hammond's. Uh, I've been working on Alan Grant's and um, a little bit of Dr. Ellie's. But I'm pretty much almost done with Alan Grant's. And then this one's going to take a little bit to get done with her. But uh, yeah, let's go continue requesting some contracts for Alan Grant or Dr. Ian Malcolm because Ian Malcolm will give them both increases Hi, so that's pretty cool uh, his own missions are really easy a, also uh, a gift if you will toward improving your standing um but yeah um i'll keep checking in and out uh getting these missions done all right four moments later john hammond wanted my endorsement nice obviously he didn't get it but i do approve of your work here let's call it a start for now all right, we completed his uh, reputation. So now we got the Baryonyx. One of the reasons I became a paleontologist is because I thought it would be fun. Easy. Sharing my joy of the prehistoric world with others in my own unique, admittedly biting at times way. And now, in you, I may have found a kindred spirit. So I want you to have this. And Ellie need never know. We had this conversation. Wonder what did he give me? Anyways, we got the Baryonics. We completed all of Dr. Alan Grant's missions. All that's left is Dr. Ellie Sadler's. So uh, let's go ahead and start doing all of that. One eternity later. En route to pick up the asset. We are pleased to welcome Perfect. There was a time when the only thing I wanted from this place was to escape it in one piece. Now, we now my feelings about Jurassic Park are changing. Just in one more. Partly because of you, I'm reconsidering my opinions. Call it hope, a gift you've given. So I hope you'll accept this one in return. En route to collect the asset. We are pleased to welcome This is good. This is really, really good. John is impressed with what you All right. Alan and Dr. Malcolm as well. And Finch? He's Finch. Me? I agree with John. We've been doing great. So we got you something as a way to say thank you. Sweet deal. I think, uh, yep, it's just this. All right. I think that was uh, our last mission. All right, yeah, it was. All right, guys, so we pretty much got all of our reputations with the doctors uh, taken care of, all 100%, so that's freaking awesome. And then we also got all of our missions completed. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Um, there were seven missions, we got all the seven done. Um, but yeah, this uh, Return to Jurassic Park DLC was, uh, really fun i thought it was really good um you know it was a what if situation if they ever did come back to come and fix the park um but yeah this was a lot of fun i saw a lot of uh like old uh like easter egg things that uh if you didn't watch the first uh movie um you're gonna miss out on a lot but um yeah if uh you guys stick to with me on this whole journey um, I really appreciate it. And, uh, yeah, don't forget to check my Facebook and don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe button. Um, but also again, I do appreciate you guys very much. Um, and, uh, I hope to see you guys next time.
Peace.